Hey, this is Genevieve West. I just discovered that Frontier Communications is gonna pay somebody a thousand dollars to binge watch all 25 hours of Friends on Netflix. And I'm like, sign me up for that because I totally do that anyway, even without a thousand dollars. So the question they asked was, who was right about the break, Ross or Rachel? Rachel was absolutely right about the break. Even Ross never calls it a breakup. He just says that they were on a break. Uh, and then he was hiding the girl behind the door. Uh, if he really thought that he was right, he'd just own it. He'd be like, yeah, this is what I did because we were on a break instead of trying to cover it up. And then super douche move. What was his plan? Like just to not disclose that sexual partner? That's messing with Rachel's physical health and safety at that point. Um, and then you have this big secret between you and that's never a good idea. Honestly, never a good idea. Just tell the truth, you guys. Oh my gosh. Um, and then if I had done the same thing to my husband, okay, if like I'm in a fight with my husband and I'm like, I just need a break. And he goes, okay, let's go get some frozen yogurt. And I'm like, I do not want frozen yogurt with you right now. I just need you to get out of my face before I go to jail for committing homicide. <laughs> Uh, that does not mean go sleep with the girl at the coffee house. It means I need some space from you. Go away. I need a break from us. And then if the situation was reversed and it was Ross needing the break and, or even, even it was Rachel needing the break still, but then she's the one who went to find someone to sleep with instead of Ross. I think that Ross would probably still agree with me. He'd be like, yeah, we were on a break. What was that about? We did not break up. It was a break. I needed a break from us, she said. Um, and then at any point, if he had just eaten a little humble pie and was like, oh my God, Rachel, you're, I'm so sorry. I was wrong. It was a mistake. Will you please forgive me? Then they just would have gotten right back together instead of those four months between the break and the 18 page long letter that she wrote him. Uh, gosh, that's even a thing in itself. Like, He's just consistently a liar. Ross, what is wrong with you? Probably my least favorite character. I'm sorry, don't throw tomatoes at me. Uh, he fell asleep reading the eight, I mean, it was handwritten, 18 pages, front and back, 5.30 in the morning. I get it, dude's tired. Just admit that you passed out. You were trying, man, you had the coffee with you. You're like trying to hang in there and stay awake for it because you really wanted to know what she was thinking, but you fell asleep. Just own up to it. So the moral of the story, tell the truth. And Rachel was right about the break.